Let me record. Oh yeah, they do get a physical damage buff with her damn R2. I actually kind of forgot that shit. I'm gonna try out that new sword on her though and see what she got going on. But she will be missing out on her fucking crit rate. Let me see. Yeah, Cause that shit's at 35. I really need that shit at 50, but hell, I can only do so much. Kill confirm. Cause her damn hat is what... Oh shit, I ain't even realize that. That's why her shit lower. Fuck, and she needs that for the two piece, don't she? Hell yeah. Damn. This shit's This is wait. legit the only fucking physical damage cut. No cap. Probably can take this all out. And just use the fucking sword for the physical damage buff. Oh, what'd you say, James? My bad, I fucking went off into it. Oh, uh, no, nah, I was saying good shit, teammate. He did some good shit. Gotcha. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're falling behind. What's this? Attack, crit rate. Oh. Um, shit, we might run this hill. The Bluetooth is connected to my. So she can have this uh, and then I just take that this one damage off and she ain't gonna fucking benefit from this shit even now. And I'll probably end up replacing the dragon spawn, but I mean, she'll just have to get away from the other thing. And honestly, her overall damage should probably increase a whole fuck time if we do that. I'm gonna try that shit out. So And move was nigga in the roof the whole entire time. Why is it? Bro, not I didn't even think my... about it. She do remind me of Ryoko a little bit. The mm. fucking hair. Shin Yan. Here, I'm gonna send you a picture. Because I've been talking about this character for a long ass time and you don't know who I'm talking about. Alright, let's see. Damn. Uh ah, hell no. That's because I'm over here messing with my, my damn headphones. Here. No, I, talk, I was talking about like for like the last couple of days. I was talking about this character. Oh, no, no. I'm, 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 I was talking about how I got killed. He coming around that corner? Damn, my goofy ass. Oh shit. Why is it not picking up my controller though? I mean my head. I probably can't I heard she's the energy recharge bow. How fast she gets her fucking ult, and then we'll have that. Now, if we need to watch, then we'll go with that. Or even if we have to do a fucking exile set to get that energy recharge up, then we'll thug that out. But we gotta have cryo bonus. This straight healer deal works. Nah, 
I don't plan on using her in DPS, so I shouldn't build her that way. Yeah, so I'll just go for the healer build and make sure she can spam her ult. I'll do that shit. Because, like I said, it's only there for a fucking elemental reaction anyway and heals. Which I need to read up. More on that so, it tosses this AoE damage and creates drunken mist of AoE. Deals continuous damage within the AoE continuous region of the HP character of the AoE. Skill damage is 80% after continuous skill damage is 52.6. So, the initial hit is 80%. So, the HP duration is that. The duration is 12 seconds, and the cooldown is 20. Energy cost is 80. Heads up, hostile gunship above. So yeah, I'm just gonna feel it as that. Her damage, <coughs> damage percentage should be okay. <laughs> Decrease in fucking defense, that would have made more fucking sense. <clears throat> Some people in the community have been saying they need to uh, make some changes to Barbara too. What the fuck is going on here? Mission complete. Increase crit rate. Against opponents frozen. Our effect of our cloud weapons. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <coughs> Let me see why it's not picking up these fucking dudes. Hold on right quick. Though. I'm still gonna be here. I'm finna see something with my headphones. I'm about to go to the restroom real quick, I'll be back. Okay.
Hola. Ugh. Is he still fixing it? Oh, that's what I was going to do. What did you do in time? I just want to your life as well. Team Hi, hello. Yeah. Eliminate all friends. Hey, this super hearing is trash. <laughs> what the hell is super hearing? Whatever it is, this shit trash and a bitch. <laughs> Is that a sitting on the uh, headset or a sitting on the It's just sitting system. on the headset. <clears throat> Interesting. Turn this whole off. I'll just say some serious. Sending Molotov. Damn. That's what I get. I was trying to get the other dude from that corner, but fuck it. Super here and shit was trash. Most of spy plane established overhead. Kill oh, me! They dropped a new DC deck though, they gave. I'm shooting at your homie and I didn't see you. <clears throat> Ooh, good shit, good shit, good shit, good shit. Yeah, I'm surprised Black War Green on is cheaper. Hostile care package inbound. Yeah, I thought that motherfucker would be more expensive. That's what I have to have to figure it out. Here getting carried away. What the fuck did I get on here for? Uh oh. Uh, what you playing? Enemy delete. Oh, I'm on my phone. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I canceled out the GR because I was uh, I need to do this stuff real quick. I knew <laughs> Come here mm -hmm. before I leave, or if I'll have to send it off up there. I was also planning on getting this uh 
one of those things that you can hang over your door frame to do pull ups and shit. Mm -hmm. I was gonna get one of them too. Talk down. Yeah. You hear me? Okay. No, I gotta. Enemy killer package Okay, there we go. Enemy spike landing down. Yeah, I was just gonna get that, and then uh, I want to get a workout bench too, but I'm gonna have to wait on that one. Probably for the next month. Enemy killer package dropped. Enemy killer package dropped. Enemy killer package dropped. I would like to have a uh. Spy planes detected. Like a workout bench. Depending on what kind you want. Uh, they range anywhere from like, uh, what, 125 to 200? You said 125? Yeah. I said depending on what kind you want. Mm -hmm. They have the straight flat ones, they have the adjustable ones, the ones that you can fold up and put out the way, all that shit. I just want it so I can uh, target other muscle areas better. Yeah. By um, like sitting down and just being in a position to do so instead of standing and doing it. Because it'll take a lot of pressure off of my back and stuff like that. And making mm -hmm. sure that that weight isn't being shifted to places that I don't want it. Yeah. So, I was planning on doing that. I gotta go back on and see what I have. But for now, I'm just gonna try to get that thing that I can make over the door frame with pull ups. Threat neutralized. Like, probably within the next like two years, uh, after my roommate move out and I'm settled in my job, I'm gonna turn his room into an indoor gym, basically. Nice. Oh, I'm standing. What, what is your teammate? Yeah. Oh shit. Ah oh, shit! I hear him. Mission goals are in sight. Take the win. Oh, this shit. I make that move. What? No, nah, because I was thinking about like probably two years from now when my roommate moves out, I was definitely gonna fix up the house the way I wanted it to, or at least the apartment. 
Oh, and so just like, I guess I don't want to get like too overboard because I definitely don't plan on living there forever. You know what I mean? So like yeah. buying a bunch of furniture and all that shit. That's what I say. So it's, it's an apartment, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, I don't do that, man. Cause. I didn't do like I didn't do that either. Like everybody was like, "Oh, when are you gonna fix up your living room? When are you gonna spice your living room? Up? I'm gonna I'm gonna start buying stuff for the living room when I know I'm finna get a house." Yeah. <clears throat> Which um, I actually want to kind of work on that soon. Like, just start like looking up like what is the criteria of like getting approved for a house. Which you pretty got to be to, you know, get approved, you know, objectives. from the bank, and, and I don't want to rent a house, I want to own a house. Enemy has alpha. I got you. Charlie locked down. Because... Taking B. Renting a house ain't gonna do nothing for me. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna go for a condo. Condo sounds pretty cool, I ain't gonna lie. Let's check and see what I can find within my range. Yeah, you should be able to find something pretty good. What's up? Yeah, you should be able to find something pretty good. Yeah, I think so. I was just looking at um the current place we're at is only eight fifty for a two bedroom and a one and a half bath. Which isn't terrible. Nah, not terrible at all. Yeah, it's in a pretty central area. It's not too far from anything. It's legit right down the street from the fucking store. All that shit. So it's a nice. It's in a nice spot. So even if I do end up staying there for a little bit until I find something that I really want, I'd probably do that. Because um. The way I look at it, if I do get the job. And I start that. Um, less than half of my check would be rent utilities you know, in my car note done. And then the rest would just go to me for groceries and then the rest into savings. Nice. So ideally, if I do move into another place, I'm going to be looking for something about the same rate. Or maybe a little bit more. Because my biggest thing is that I still want to have, like, I still want to save a lot at the end of the month, for sure. Taking Bravo. My expenses really aren't much. I spend like probably 100 bucks on groceries. And that lasts me for a while. <clears throat> and I don't really do any spending until like. Christmas time, really, and that's it. That's why I was selling my uh, oh shit, that hit me. That's why I was selling my coworkers. Like, I don't spend no more than a hundred bucks on groceries. <clears throat> yeah. 
but all my true savings won't start until after I finish paying off my loans. And then after I pay them off, then I plan on paying my car off as soon as possible. And then mm. I can really start my savings. And then I won't even have to worry about the fucking car note anymore. So I'll be saving over half of my chip as savings every month. And that's it, uh... And honestly, it's gonna be even more than that. Cause my roommate, he ain't going nowhere until like probably two years, honestly. Cause, um, his girl keep bugging him about moving in. But he keeps saying he ain't gonna move in until he know he ready. And he's established and can like, actually be on time with bills and shit, but... Unless the government just say fuck it and give everybody a shit ton of money, that, ain't, that shit not happen at any time soon with him. Damn, for real. Hell no. Nah. He already over 50k in the hole in terms of student loans. He owed me probably about still seven or eight hundred dollars. Damn. Yeah. Switching rally points. Oh, yeah. That shit ain't happening no time soon. And right now, he's still pinching pennies and he still can't even pay me right now. Because at first, we was doing like a hundred a month, but now he can't even afford that shit. Securing Alpha. <clears throat> he worked though, right? Yeah, he, hell yeah, he worked. If not, he was coming to miss the fuck. That's the next question. Hell yeah, he worked. Enemy <laughs> he worked two jobs. A secure. Bravo lockdown. Yeah, he need to find a, a, a real second job. This motherfucker said, fuck it. He thought, because, bro, he's not original at all. So, you know I used to be on that grind of pizza hut, right? Mm -hmm. But I put in that work. This motherfucker lazy as hell. This, this same dude I told you about once before, remember? But the dude that's taking care of and all that shit. And okay, yeah. Seven, yeah. Doing two for 20 for himself at Chili's. Oh, that nigga. Yeah. that nigga. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be telling me all about that shit. I was like, what the hell? Yeah. Two for 20 for that's yourself? I that's can't even saying, do that. Man. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah. But nah. So, he decided he'll try to work at Domino's. So, he's been working there. And the thing is, like, the way Denton is set up, it's a college town. So, of course, they're going to hire a bunch of drivers. Which means, when it's slow, they send you home. Which means, no money. Also, the way Domino's work is that drivers get paid less than the in-store fee. They don't even make minimum wage. So really, all your money comes from tips. So in reality, he ain't making shit. <clears throat> from that job, you might as well find you a second job on the side that's actually doing something to make some real money. Because right now, he can't even afford to give me the extra hundred. And that's with his fucking sister staying there and the bills being cut. So my question is, when she fucking move out, what the hell are you gonna do? Cause it sounds to me like you can't even afford living here right now. Nah. And I already heard about this distribute, like, uh, everybody getting this 600 for this, uh, or whatever. Mm -hmm. From the government. Now I'm gonna talk to him and let him know. You're really getting five, cause 100 coming my way. Cause it's been a minute, bro. <laughs> yeah, let him know. Yeah, and apparently his sister has been like helping him pay bills and shit since 2018. Nah, dog, you lying. I'm not. They've been helping him pay shit since 2018. That's how long he's been using his sister to pay this shit. It took his entire family, younger siblings included, that's like in high school and shit working. To be able to get him to go back to college. And then he almost failed. He made a scene in the class because of a participation grade. If it weren't for that participation grade, he would have made a D in the winning count. You lying. No, I ain't lying. I ain't making this shit up. Enemy has captured the flag. Oh, 
And the only reason he started going back to school was because of this girl telling him he should do this, should do that. She's looking up all the stuff. She's doing everything for him. Helping him sign up for the classes, all this shit. I was like, why are you sitting here raising this man? Yeah. As much as I didn't want to say it like that, yeah. Ah, shit, I'm reloading. Right, my biggest thing is, how fucking desperate are you? Hey, you talking about asking for her? Yes. bothered me at one point is when I was trying to get the health coach position he was like that's an actual job and I was like yep yeah. he was like so there's people that like can't do for themselves yeah like some people need help it's called a support system yeah. and I was thinking about it like a couple of days later and I was like this motherfucker really judging people because they need a support system and he has the biggest support system there is you got your girl doing all your shit for you. You got your sister paying all your fucking bills. What the hell you mean? How you gonna knock some people that need help and you in the same fucking position? So you think you better than that? Yeah, that's what it sounds like. <laughs> I ain't trying to make fun of him, but yeah, that's what it sounds like. Go feel, let's go. I don't know. Dude just got that mentality that the world owe him. What you got That's what I'm saying, bro. And basically, if something doesn't align with what he wants, then fuck them. That's the mentality he got. If it doesn't benefit him, then fuck them or whatever they got going on. Well, what he really should do is just go out there and work just like everybody else. And deal with the shit. Because he just waiting for handouts. He really want uh, everything to... Uh, to shut down so he could potentially get further so he can sit at home and do nothing. That's what he wants. Perseus does not tolerate fear. I don't want shit. I mean, I got a job that pays me either way. I, I don't want shit to shut down. And then the word on the street is. That they don't even know if we're going to school, going back to school. Oh, for real? Yeah, I had talked to uh, Ansi, <coughs> excuse me, yesterday. And uh, he was like, he was like, James, they don't even know if we're going to go back to school. And I was like, what? He was like, yeah, now to talk about it is, uh, no, I'm not playing Hardpoint. Uh, he was like, the talk now is that they think they're gonna go back to virtual. And I was like, that's not gonna work, man. Like, we, the reason why we getting the more kids now is because parents ain't being fucking parents, man. <clears throat> like, no, we have legit so many kids coming back because of the fact that they 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 feel it. They feeling virtual. Yeah, cause ain't nobody there to help them. It's legit school. Ain't you? It's not just oh we're gonna fuck around on the computer and pass our classes. Yeah, and parents is not doing nothing to help. Uh, a lot of the people that's like virtual and caught trying to get a hold of the parents is like, hey, like he gonna have to come back because like he's feeling virtual. Parents ain't picking up the phone. Cause they don't give a fuck. Cause half them hoes got kids and didn't even want them. Exactly. 
I'm just like, yo, like. It sounds fucked up, but shit, it's the truth. And then, like, this really pinpoints, like, who who is a dedicated parent, like, doing their job as a parent, and who's not. Yeah. Because, oh, you chose virtual because, which, yeah, there's been a lot of cases at the school going on, I'm not going to lie. Not at mine's, but there's been a couple of cases with little kids, but mm-hmm. ain't been like that. What the fuck is this? Oh, t- uh, so yeah, I get it. You know what I'm saying? You wanted to be safe and keep your kid at home, but that comes with work. Like, you need to work with your kid. You just can't sit there and have them do nothing, you know what I'm saying? Like team deathmatch. Spetsnaz Garu, you have execute authority. My bro, I completely understand what you're saying. Shit, man, for for one month, uh, a whole month, bro, a whole month and a half actually going almost on two. I hate this map with a passion, and I hate when t- when Call of Duty just throw me in a fucking match. We can go ass down them stairs. Not now. But uh this one kid legit was like not logging in, not doing a goddamn thing for two whole months. Oh you know what? I think I emailed them on my Gmail. We're full to head. And shit, I believe it, because half the time the parents don't even check what the fuck they kid doing. And, uh, I, I hate it when parents get upset when they don't find out till like mid school year that they kid is failing. Or not even find out till like the end of the six week mark. Like you should be asking your fucking kid what's going on with school. How are things going? And then if you know your kid, don't just go by their word, actually look at the shit. Exactly. But don't nobody give a fuck. Hey, bro. Good old stupid Texas. Um, That's from EA. Fuck. I forgot who the hell I emailed this through. Or what the hell the name of that email was. I don't think it was that one. Damn, they giving me bullshit ass maps, man. Bro, why the fuck Galveston Bay still emailing me shit? Mm. I'm pretty sure this is about my damn poster. Oh, that was, uh, yeah. I was pretty sure that's what that was. Here, go back real quick. It'll be in there if I did send it to them so I can at least see what fucking email. <clears throat> okay, that was sent in February. Oh, that shit from last year. Okay, so I definitely didn't send it through that email. I don't think I used my business email. Okay, let's try this. I need to email Miss Green. Oh shit, it must have been my business email. Why the fuck did I use that one? Team Deathmatch. Everybody the going. Soldier. The folks back home are counting on you. Pulling ahead. Yep, sure did. I'm a dumbass. Sending that off. 
So I need to get those damn SD cards. Alright, now. So this is what I'm probably going to end up doing. For the store? Huh? For what? Uh... Hey, you said school. School too! But we'll talk about that later. <laughs> okay. Uh... Goofy ass nigga. <laughs> oh my god, my heart was beating so fucking fast, dog. I'm so confused. My bad. This is a good, good ass game. Damn, I couldn't get him. Uh, so, this is the game plan. I'm going to buy. When it goes on sale, I'm going to get. Damn. I'm gonna get Call of Duty for you. You're gonna play. You're gonna play it. You're gonna like it. You're gonna love it. Because I can't do this shit no more by myself, no. <laughs> I just can't, man. This shit is frustrating. Like, I legit had like a five kill streak. I'm so dead ass, bro, because I'm oh, <laughs> dumb. Look, 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 I just took out three niggas, bro. Look, 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 look. Let me tell you something, bro. Look, okay, look. You know, I play competitive. You know what I'm saying? Every now and then, I, you know, every now and then. You know what I'm saying? Get a little, get a little bit of competitive. But I know Newtown map like the back of my hand, bro. So it's like, if they was just to follow my order and follow my lead, we will be a okay. We could lock down one whole side, dog. Okay. Like, now I need to get back into reading my fucking book. I understand that you know it's it's fun to rip around and run around and shit, but when we down, it ain't fun in games no more. Saying like, that, damn. Damn, AP. Uh, PS4 don't take this no more. Well, it's acting funky with this. Didn't that shit try to eat his uh, kingdom hearts? <clears throat> nah, that was me. Remember. Oh yeah, that's right. What what did his eat? Uh, the pirate warriors. Yeah. Oh shit, these hoes. Oh, I think this is uh. Damn, I gotta reload. I think they dropped the um, what you call it for slime. Uh, a recap episode because they got they dropped twenty four point nine today. Oh, so they starting? Yeah. Oh shit, Clover out too. <laughs> Noel's face. I like her new design. It's funny. Oh bro, I can't wait to see this OP. So requesting spy plane testing. My boy Austin Jack, bro. That whole bigger than y'all be dog. Nah, he ain't bigger than y'all dog. Them hoes like the same size now, bro. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah, yeah. Dang. I'll show you a screenshot in a minute after I start this episode. I'm trying to get this shit down. Uh, yeah, because I need to see what, uh, this shit. I guess I'll do this tomorrow. Because I ain't gonna have time. Uh, to do this today. Plus, my ass woke up late again. Uh,. I'm done going to bed at midnight. That shit's over. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me, but I have a hard time going to sleep now. I don't know why. Dom. I didn't go to sleep until like 2.33 o'clock. Are you shit serious? I'm so dead. Like when I got off, I still didn't go to bed until that time. Damn. I don't know why, bro. I don't, I don't know what's going on. And I, I really, I really think it's because like my AC problem, bro. Like if I, 
I gotta get that shit checked out. If I'm hot, I can't sleep. Like, the AC has to be set at 70. Cause like what I, what I was doing at first, I had my AC set at 73, and then, oh uh, shit, and then I had uh my fan on, but I didn't see. I I didn't have my portable fan. I had my portable. I normally have my portable fan on full blast, rotating in it, rotating around. But this time I didn't have it on full blast and it wasn't rotating around. Damn, I did not know this about this position. Not to cut you off though. I oh, know you good. That was just like. I guess I'm ne not too set against that. I guess it just depends on the scheduling. I don't know how I feel about evenings though. Yeah, I'm about to put that as one of my fucking questions. I need a time frame. Cause I ain't no bad. You did the work of a nation. Victory screech. Hostile force Honestly, it doesn't bother me too much because at least when I get off, I know I'm coming straight home because everybody else gonna be at home already. Yeah. But I just wanna know how fucking late are we gonna be working exactly? And since my shit's salary, it don't even fucking matter anyway in terms of hours. Uh, yeah. Time frame for this evening and weekend shift.